happening now, a risky and possibly painful response to a tractor trailer wreck. Take a look. This big rig was hauling at least 400 beehives when it rolled. There are now likely millions of bees in a swarm making efforts to clean up this mess a real challenge. Sky 5 showing it to you from way above. News Channel 5's Jennifer Reyes is in Mount Juliet live at a safe distance, I should mention, to show us what's being done. Jennifer. <laughs> Yes, we've been very fortunate that we really haven't seen too many bees where we are. But I, I do want to show you here behind me that this is there's there's still a lot of action happening down there. That is because uh, some uh, people in bee suits are pulling out 450 beehives that at one point were on the, on their side. Now they didn't want to put that uh, tractor trailer upright because then they would have killed. A significant amount of bees and this is some video that we shot earlier today when we first got here uh, they really didn't know what to do with the bees there was a huge hole on the tractor trailer and they were just trying to contain them to that tractor trailer many residents many people who live around here came outside to see what was going on some of them that were brave enough to get closer to the scene did get stung several times emergency vehicles and even um, some sheriff's deputies remained in their car though because they knew that if they got out they would be stung but luckily though no major injuries here and the plan right now is to take all 450 beehives and put them into a different tractor trailer and then get it out of here they're hoping to do that maybe in the next few hours but they say they could be here for the rest of the night which means that uh block will remain closed no through traffic through uh, they're not letting traffic through rather and we did learn that the driver of that semi is actually from California he put the address on his GPS and unfortunately it took him the wrong way that is the latest from Wilson County I'm Jennifer Reyes News Channel 5 and we're continuing our Facebook coverage uh, on Facebook this is a Facebook live feed from News Channel 5 reporter Anyone and part-time beekeeper Nick Barris. Nick has been giving us real time coverage of the wreck near his home in Mount Juliet. It's something to see folks go to our Facebook page to check it out.